Hello friends. If you want to display some data in a model from database, you can use Ajax in PHP to get the data from the database and display it on the model. You can use bootstrap model and pass a parameter to the model, then run an Ajax script to get the data from the database. In this video, I'll show you how we can display dynamic data in a model using Ajax with PHP and MySQL. A simple example I am showing here, I am displaying all the courses in a HTML table. Course detail is not displayed here. Instead, there is a link, view details. If you click on it, it will be displayed in the model. So the Ajax script is bringing the data from the database and displaying it in the model. So you can see that this is the data which is being displayed in a model and this data is coming from the database. So this is a very simple example of how to use Ajax to display data dynamically from the database. So let's see how we can develop this using PHP, MySQL and Ajax. You can see I have created a modal folder under XAMPP HTDocs and I will keep all the folders and files in this modal folder. So far I have just created index.php. Let me show you this in Visual Studio code. So CFG folder, I have created dbconnect.php to connect to database. I am using a demo database. And I have kept style sheet in CSS folder. DB folder, I have database table creation script and the data I am inserting in this table. So this is a training course table I am using. And index.php is the home page that I have created here just to display the courses in a HTML table. I am just selecting all the data from training courses and displaying them in a HTML table. And in this index.php, I have created a model. So in this model, this is a bootstrap model. And this model has header, body and footer. You can see in the body, I have not written anything in this body. So this is blank. So this will be populated dynamically using Ajax. Let me show you the database. This is the demo database I am using here. And this is the training courses table. And you can see the data here. Course name, price and course details. So the structure of the table is this. Now if you go to index.php, as of now I have just displayed the details in a table, HTML table. So far I have not written any Ajax script to view the details in the model. So if you run it now, so it is just showing view details. There is no link here and you cannot see the details in a model as of now. I will show you how you can write script to view the details in a model. So here, we will call the model. You can see the model is defined here and ID of the model is show details. So let us call the model here. You can see the course ID is being sent to the model. So if we run it now, you can see the model is called model is being displayed, but there is no data because we have not written the Ajax script yet. So let us do that now. So we'll write a separate JavaScript file for Ajax. So we'll create a new folder JS and save it in JS folder. So first thing we have to get the modal parameter that was sent and we'll get that first the course ID and then write the Ajax script. So I am using on click event that is view details on click event I am using and I am using the class that is given in the 
details if you see view details i am using the class as view so i am using that class here In the success, we have to write the output in the modal body. So in the modal body, if you see in the modal body, I'm using a class modal body here. So let us use this class to write the Ajax response. So this is our Ajax script. Now we have to write the PHP code to get the details from the database. You can see the course ID parameter was sent by Ajax here. Uh, this is the course ID. So using post method. So we have to use that post method here. Course ID we got. And using this course ID, we'll get the details from the database. Let me save this first. I made a mistake here. I need to save script.js to JS folder. So let me just move it. So we have selected the data from the database and executed it. And then we are just writing course name, course details and the price. And this should be the Ajax response and we'll display this in the model. So let us run it now. So data is not coming. So because we have not included script file in our index.php so now data is coming but there is some issue here so let us fix that so now we can see the details are coming from the database and it is displayed in the model so this is the uh, details of the course and the price is also displayed and this is the course name so it's coming for all the courses now so this way you can develop this application to fetch data from the database and display it in the model dynamically hope you could understand this and if you like it please give a like to the video and subscribe my channel you can also go to the website codehowto.com and there you can see the details development step given for this topic you can download the source code free you don't need to sign up or register you can see the links given in the video description if you like it please give a like and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching the video